Okay guys, today I have with me the a Dobo or Double Power 7 inch tablet PC. It's the uh, M7088. Um, has a dual core processor. Now this is a 7 inch tablet that has a dual core processor. 8 gigabytes of storage, 10, uh, 1 gigabyte of memory, 7 inch HD display, micro SD card slot, G sensor has capacitive touchscreen, Android 4.1, music and video amongst other stuff. So let's uh, hear the features here again. It has a 1024 by 600 HD multi touch screen and it says enjoy 1080p movies on a slim panel. Okay, let's your model number again M7088. Alright, let's open it up and uh, take a look at it. Okay, we get started here. We take off the box of this double power tablet but there at the side and of course you have here uh, your tablet encased in a nice fabric like uh, material um, let's see what else is inside the box here before we go ahead with that we have we take this out and we have uh, USB cords uh, here's one USB cord right here and we have another one right here and we have a wall charger uh, that, that you plug into the tablet and also you have uh, a booklet from Double Power that has already user manual and let's put this back in here and let's take a look a closer look at the tablet okay right here we have the tablet here we're gonna take it out of the uh, case and uh, here it is. Wow, it's a nice, uh, nice size. It's seven inches. You can see here. Has your front-facing camera. Um, nice, uh, thin profile. You can see here. You have your power button at the top. Your volume rocker here at the top as well. Uh, at the bottom here, you have your uh, micro SD card slot. The back has a nice silver uh, color to it. Um, feels almost like metal um, you have your double power logo here dopo you have uh, some words words made in uh, and the model number of course over here you have a rear facing camera so this has both front and back cameras you have a one speaker grill over here you can see right here if you could see it there and uh, let's see your connections right here you have a headphone jack on one side on the left side there and on the right side you have uh, over here you have your USB right there uh, you have a mic right here and you can see here you have a HDMI okay an HDMI output here uh, your DC charger here and a reset button over here and uh, of course I said again your micro SD card slot sometimes they call it a trans TF card slot so uh, let's uh, t uh, power, it, power it on and uh, let's see what uh, this, ta this tablet offers. Okay, let's turn it on now by turning on with the power button here at the top. We hold it down for a couple seconds, see if there's any juice to it. Okay, there we go. Turns on right now. Has the double power logo. And let's wait till it starts up here. Okay, we're gonna wait here a little bit until it starts up, and I'm gonna turn on the light so we can just have a much better view. Once it starts up, okay, there he goes. Has the time and the unlock button here by sliding it to the right. Okay, says so make yourself at home. Touch here to see all your apps. Touch here to see all your apps. I'm gonna choose some apps. You could choose some apps as well, and uh, well, here it is. I'm bringing it up a little bit much cl closer to you so you can see it. Um, over here, you have your Adobe Reader. Um, you have a Adico or a Aldico app. Your browser, a, a calculator, a camera, clock. Let's take a look at the uh, camera by pressing the camera button right here. Let's see what. Touch that camera right here. 
and of course we have the rear facing camera right here as you can see and uh, let's put something there for you so we could show you um, okay here it is the rear facing camera um, of course you have your zoom functions as well by going like this to zoom and going back out like this to uh, bring it out again of course this is to take a picture you press this button here to take a picture right there and the pictures right here now if you t take out a video there's a video button here that you could take out a um, you could also take it says here touch to take photo while recording so that's a that's apparently a, a nice feature okay so let's uh, go back home now by uh, clicking on the home button right here and this is your home screen right here and uh, the home screen has Play Store of course not found on many cheap tablets um, uh, this tablet runs in about the hundred dollar range uh, hundred and fifty dollars between one hundred and hundred fifty dollars um, you have your YouTube app here um, your camera your settings and gallery um, let's take a look at your settings and we could take a look at um, right now Wi-Fi is off um, we're gonna see we're gonna look for you have a HDMI sitting here storage um, you have uh, your storage space here is 3.69 gigabytes um, your battery uh, we take a look at the battery is 39% not charging so it's kind of low the battery we could charge it later um, you have your uh, let's go down to about the tablet click here about the tablet at the bottom let's see what we get of course you got the model number this runs Android 4.1.1 as you can see there and you got some some other information here and uh, let's go back home now by pressing the home button okay so let's see if we could uh, see what else we have here we have a widget here that's most common on uh, let's go back home I just clicked YouTube by accident all right so over here you have um, uh, your a widget here that you could turn up the screen brightness or, or lower it um, or make it automatic which is a over there you could turn it back down again and turn it back on you have your Wi-Fi of course you have location and other stuff as well and uh, your home screen again and uh, go back and forth seems uh, pretty fluid here the home screen and back uh, go back to your apps by clicking that let's see the browser we click on the browser to see where, where we're gonna have every page because we don't have the Wi-Fi turned on but let's just click on it anyway web page not available we go to our settings by clicking over here and go to the settings and we're gonna turn on the Wi-Fi by clicking this here yeah, nope wrong one this one here I'm gonna enter the password here and uh, let's go back here enter the password by entering it in the button here okay okay let's done let's enter now connect see if we're gonna get in okay I probably have it man, it's probably on now okay let's go home check the browser again we can go online let's try to go to Google Oh, I probably entered the wrong password information. Let's go back to settings. Okay, now I'm connected there, so let's go back. I'll go to Google now. Let's try it again. There he goes. We have the pass. We have the Wi-Fi set up right now, and we're at the Google front page. Okay, let's go back. And uh, this uh, this is your profile. It's a nice. Uh, isn't very heavy. Um, looks like it's very um, portable that you could put in your pocket. Or purse um, and walk around with and um, the back has a metal feel to it um, has a nice feel nice camera uh, the back camera there and let's see the front camera if we could get a view okay so let's take a look at your front camera go to camera right now and here it is already had it set you could change it here by going to the rear camera 
by clicking this uh, button there and it takes you to the rear camera right here and you click it back it takes you to the front camera right here hello how are you you see my face right there of course and now we go back home by clicking uh, let's see if we can go back home by uh, uh, go back home by uh, going home let's see if we can get out of here best way to get out of here okay there he goes all right so this is the uh, the tablet itself uh, seems really nice um, I like it so far and uh, it's gonna be my new best friend and I I hope you enjoyed watching this video um, if you want me to show you something else I could probably show it to you uh, just leave a comment in the comment section or if you have any questions um, I'll, I'll try to get back to you as soon as I can um, but I thank you for watching this video of the uh, double power uh, brand uh, M7088 tablet the 7 inch tablet uh, that has a, a nice screen that runs Android 4.1.1 and so I thank you for watching and I'll see you next time